This is what firefighters were dealing with when they arrived at the alpaca farm at 186 Swain Road in Barrington. We had a fully involved uh, bonfire with an apartment in the barn. That would spread to include a couple of smaller buildings. The fire was reported around quarter to one in the morning. The lady uh, that lives there uh, heard uh, glass breaking, the dog started to bark. Uh, so she got up to investigate, opened the door out into the barn, saw a heavy fire, so she closed the door and took off to the neighbor's house to call the fire department. The chief says it was strictly a defensive operation, made more difficult by the location. It's a dead-end dirt road, uh, so we had to shuttle water to the scene. There was no uh, water close and available. The fire would eventually go to three alarms to bring additional tankers and firefighters to the scene. The intense heat scorching about half an acre, but fortunately not starting any brush fires. Uh, thankfully, we've got some rain in the last three or four days, uh, so that certainly helped us. But uh, had we not had any rain, yeah, that would have been a real big concern. It took about two and a half hours to get the fire under control but nothing is left standing except for the chimney. The building's a total loss. One firefighter did suffer a minor injury when he stepped on a nail. The chief says he was set down just strictly as a precaution. In Barrington, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.